Welcome back. So we've got Larry, Dave, and Ed from the Vietnam Veterans Chapter 941 to tell us all about their mission. Welcome, guys, and thank you so much for your service. You're welcome. Our thank pleasure. you. Thank you very much. So let's talk with you, Dave. What is uh, Chapter 941 to you? Uh, chapter 941, <laughs> it's a lot of things. Uh, uh, we do a lot of good work in this, this community. I guess uh, it's all about who we are. That this whole uh, Vietnam Vets thing was, was founded back in 1978 wow. through an act of Congress. Uh, we do a lot of things uh, for uh, veterans, our community, uh, veterans' families. That's amazing. So let me ask you this. Uh, Larry, tell me about the purpose and your mission. Well, our purpose is we will never abandon veterans again like the other groups have been abandoned over the years. And our mission, you know, we um, go out in the community and service people that need help, like um, the homeless shelter, Gladys Ray Shelter, the VA, uh, down in uh, Lisbon, you got the veterans home, got one in Fergus Falls. So we are there supporting them and raising money to, for that purpose. That's what our run's all about on Monday. Okay. Yeah, it's all, all charitable. That's beautiful. So Ed, tell me about the fundraising. The fundraising has increased over the years uh, since uh, we've come into, uh, into uh, activities throughout the community for you know veterans and civilians and their families. Um, the d donations, um, Larry, uh, our chapter president, uh, has done a wonderful job and uh, very instrumental in acquiring these donations from area uh, businesses and, and private donors as well. So how does this effort help with the VVA? It gets us outside of the room yeah. and uh, into the community. And uh, there's so many, believe it or not, there's so many veterans and families that do not know um, the, the things they need to know, right? You know, benefits, medical comps, uh, all this, and uh, I, um, if I have anything to do with it, I'll make sure that they, they uh, get that know. information. <laughs> so, Larry, tell me about that. Okay, there's one thing too. There's a distinction between the Vietnam veterans and the VFW. Yes. Even though we belong to the VFW, yeah. um, the Vietnam, Vietnam veterans, like uh, Dave said, was through an act of Congress that we are here. And so if you're sitting at home and you're wondering, um, you can belong to both. We're a very unique organization. Yes. I keep telling people, if you come to a meeting, you don't go away with a smile, there's something wrong. There's something. Right. <laughs> yeah. So Dave, what do you like most about the VVA? Uh, just getting out, the camaraderie with, with the guys uh, gets me back into a spirit of being a part of something right rather than just being away from everything yeah so what are some of the issues that you guys are facing that you guys need help with or need more efforts whether it be financial or volunteering I I wish to uh, speak on that one um, one major issue is um, the agent orange issue uh, that uh, we were faced with over there and uh, for so long, I venture and will venture to say uh, to everyone, uh, our government did not recognize us mm -hmm. in that uh, area. And um, there's so many symptoms that have uh, happened to the veteran, and not only to the veteran, to their families. Uh, some of the defoliants in, in Agent Orange last from five to seven generations. Wow. And w I need personally to get that information out to those people that need it out there and uh, it's a sore spot I opened up a can of worms and I walked right in <laughs> <laughs> right well Dave Ed and Larry thank you guys so much for coming here showcasing the VVA and the efforts and the issues that are at hand we want to thank you for allowing us to be here thank you for no, allowing us to be here our run does start on Monday at 830 at, 830. at Bonanza Bell and Perfect. one more thing the state meeting is um, on the 15th of July at Castleton Vest Club 
And in the morning of the 16th, uh, there will be a 10 o'clock meeting. Uh, we serve lunch, breakfast, and um, families are more than welcome as, as far as the civilians, the citizens of the town. Perfect. Beautiful. Yep. Well, thank you guys so much. Well, thank you. Up next, we will be talking to the iconic All for One. Up next.